Winston Churchill said the destiny of man is not measured by material computations. When great forces are on the move in the world, we learn we're spirits, not animals. He said there's something going on in time and space and beyond time and space, which, whether we like it or not, spells duty. You and I have a rendezvous with destiny. We'll preserve for our children this, the last best hope of man on earth, or we'll sentence them to take the last step into the thousand years of darkness. Sometimes I don't know what to say. It's a genuine miracle I woke up today, so I got up to pray. But my BBM was pinging when my Android started singing. Then I missed all of the glory for technological luxuries. And just like that, I forgot all of the trees and the flowers and the breeze carrying seeds across the seas. Extra honey in my tea, but pay no homage to the bee. Whatever happened to us? And will we ever let the magic come and tap into us? We preach apocalypse written by John the Revelator, but won't even speak to a stranger riding on the elevator. I step to the side when we stand still on the escalator. The planet Earth is a hospital, we on the respirator. I don't regret the haters. Sometimes that's what you need to see yourself break through and free yourself. Accept your own and be yourself is magic. The story of life is too tragic. This is the turn, they ain't ready for prestige yet, the flow is too collegiate, the show is too prestigious, pretty like a flower, refreshing like a shower, depression makes me sour, but it's still a feeling, my human heart and all my senses say it's still appealing, I could be dead and gone, a brass band, a second line, I could be headed home. Passes by me, shed a tear after she read the stone. It's luxury. The story of life is not tragic. It's magic. Sometimes that's what you need to see yourself. Break through and free yourself. Accept your own and be yourself. It's magic. The story of life is not tragic, it's a luxury.